Hey, what's up, my construction entrepreneurs? Tyrone Jones here with the Construction Entrepreneur School and Services. Um, man, so I didn't do a video yesterday because I just had so much work I needed to get done. It was just crazy. Um, so I'm here at the office. So I scheduled my week last week to make sure I'm here full day Thursday, which was yesterday, and a full day Friday, which is today. So uh, yesterday I got, uh, it, I wouldn't say I was, I was very productive. I did get some stuff done, but um, I didn't lay out a schedule. So I didn't feel that I could have gotten as much done as I should have gotten done in that day, you know, uh, uh, having an office to go to definitely requires a different structure, uh, particularly for myself, um, that I know I need to put forth. So today I did, I got a list of things I need to make sure that uh, I take care of in order uh, and get right to it. One of the things was to do a videos to show you guys what's going on and document this journey because my great, great grandkids are going to benefit from this. Um, um, but so far, we're doing good. Uh, you guys can tell that, you know, we're, 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 we're in, a, uh, in, in the inner community. We've still got a lot of work to do here uh, at the office. Uh, uh, brought a desk in, one desk in, brought a couch in. Uh, um, uh, building, you know, with the, uh, the partnership we created with sublease in this area here, we are going to build them uh, some stuff in the back there. So I'll show you the progress with that as well. We kind of got a little bit up so far. Um, so we're happy with that. But overall, we're, we're happy to be in here. Um, we're, we're still moving forward. Like I say, I'm restructuring a lot of things here. Um, also, too, let me... Um, let me update you on that uh, that that free service that I talked about that small businesses should know about that we're taking advantage of and I took advantage of years ago. Um, um, so I finally found a number for this area. Every county has their own uh, in in California. Every county has their own program that handles this type of resource. So what it is, is that I was like, oh man, it's, it's rest care. You know, I'm looking for rest care, but that was the problem. So in San Diego is rest care, but here in, um, let me see here. Oh, you sent me the permit. So I finally got the permit for uh, Rosewood. So we're going to get, I'm going to get started on that too. So, um, it looks like the thing is called um, Transitional Subsidized Employment Program. So TSE program. Um, and it's a, a basically an eight month OJT worksite contract. Um, let me see here. Yeah, I don't know what the OJT stand for, you know, but uh, it's, uh, yeah, I don't know what the OJT stands for. Basically, uh, you got to have workers comp, you got to have your insurances, uh, you got to have a place of business. And I don't, I don't know if necessarily you need an office. You can have a home-based business as well. I think that's fine as well. I mean, a business is a business with insurance is insurance. So, um, but basically they provide people with the experience um, of what you need. So I'm going to have people in here doing customer service, sales, uh, and scheduling, right? So I'm going to get two people in here, whether man or girl, doesn't matter. Um, and they're going to be uh, calling other GCs or other um, uh, uh, mitigation companies, restoration companies to drum up business. We want to start receiving more proposals, more uh, RFPs, uh, more requests for jobs from these companies that we're looking to kind of channel towards. Okay, so one person will be doing that every day. Okay, um, uh, in combination with some other things to kind of fill up fill up the day and break up that, you know, 
And then the next person would handle more of the admin stuff along with uh, our other admin girl that we kind of lost to maybe a part-time status here moving into next month. So uh, we handle more admin stuff with job tracking, uh, PO system, you know, you should have a PO system to where you can track purchases, charge those purchases toward the job that it actually is supposed to be on so you can actually track that cost. Uh, uh, scheduling, uh, you know, emailing, contacts, follow up with invoicing. Uh, so they do a little bit of, uh, uh, you know, accounts receivable, accounts payable, uh, if they have that type of talent. You know, we'll see if we can get someone in here that has a little bit of that uh, because they, they they definitely have to wear many hats until we can get up to that next level. Um, so that's why I'm bringing this. So the, the, the way the program works is that the first four months is no charge to the business owner. Literally, the program pays that person wage for four months fully. For the next four months, right, which is now the transition of, uh, of, of working to get hired, the next four months, the business owner commits to paying that person's salary, whatever you agree on, paying that person's salary, and then that program reimburses the business owner 60% uh, of that person's salary for four months. And then after the, eight, the total eight-month period, you bring that person on. But, you know, during the process, this is all, you know, there's no commitment. I don't have to keep that person on board. I can change that person. I'll bring someone else in, start that process, you know. So you're looking for the right person, the right fit. Uh, so it's no commitment that you have to do, even though it's such a sweet deal. Uh, now, mind you, on programs like this, it's, it, sometimes it's just hard to find the right type of people to come in. Uh, might get lucky, get you know, get the right person in and, and get the rock and roll in it. And within that eight months time, we bring them on full time. So, oh, by the way, so that second half of four months, they will reimburse, reimburse the owner 60% of that person's pay up to $20 an hour. So now, you know, after that person went through this uh, program, now they can, you know, start earning some decent money. Um, 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 well, after the four months, they can actually earn some decent money, man, and start looking at this more of a uh, career focus uh, future, you know? So that's exciting. So hopefully we get someone in here that, you know, we can change some lives around here and, uh, and, and get some motivation back into the community and, um, and just help out a little bit, a little bit at a time where we can. So that's the goal there. Um, other than that, uh, you come next week, you're gonna see me more out in the field. So I'm gonna be doing more out in the field, managing these jobs, making sure we're flowing, uh, controlling a lot of the uh, field work while I have my partner in here, uh, handling a lot of the estimates. Uh, and I'm also gonna be feeding them estimates and I'm also gonna be doing estimates as well. So, you know, we both got a lot on our plate. We gotta be focused. At the same time, we got so much other things going on coming at us in the business and personally that we need to make sure we maintain and, can, and keep that constant growth. So it's very exciting for this next couple of months. I'm gonna take you guys along with this journey. So uh, bear with me, I'm not a blogger or whatever that is, you know what I'm saying? I'm trying to increase my, uh, my video uh, output, right? Making sure our video and video and video um, you know, with, with more locations, like yesterday, I could have videoed, I hit two other, uh, smaller jobs, uh, for a buddy of ours. Um, we're going to be going to city of Pasadena today to get on a, a project where they're requiring local, uh, contractors. So we got a location in Pasadena too, right? So we, we opened up the location in Pasadena, a satellite office in Pasadena. Let me say there's no bodies over there. It's a satellite office. So we can participate in the programs for contractors over there to where they want us to, to do 30% local hiring. So there's pro this is another thing that you got to realize, uh, you know, the resources around you. So there's, there's, there's contracts around you. That's why we in here in, in LA too, and in the community, right? Because there's, there's programs set aside for contractors uh, whether and these programs doesn't matter if you black, white, Mexican, whatever it is, okay? Uh, 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 they're just looking for local contractors. Now, the the minority 
set aside, it's different than what I'm saying this. This is more local hiring. So Pasadena has a, a I want to say it's, it's $200 million project. Um, I don't know how long it's going to be going on for. I know we're getting on it a little bit late, uh, but you have to be a local uh, contractor. So we just got a, res, uh, a location in your satellite office. Uh, so we got to work past that initial step, right? Like, hey, you're new here. You only came here for this opportunity. Uh, but we also come in here with a vast amount of experience of, of hiring local hires. You know, uh, I've done it plenty of times through all the public works projects I've done in LA, San Diego, and uh, throughout Southern California, uh, through existing projects we got now. So we go in there with a vast amount of experience to show them that, hey, just because we're new to Pasadena, we're still going to contribute uh, probably more than a 30% goal that you need to uh, achieve per contractor. Um, so we're supposed to be going to Pasadena today to really talk with someone, sit down. So hopefully I can do a video there. I think the biggest thing about me doing videos is getting the people around me used to doing, you know, being in the video uh, or being comfortable being in the video. So that's, that's another hard thing. And it's just me with a phone. So maybe I need to get a cameraman that looks more legit, right? So anybody out there that's in the LA area that want to follow me around with a camera, you hit me up. Hit me up, let me know. Maybe we can work something out. Um, um, so we're supposed to go into Pasadena today at some point during the day and um, 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 really, you know, discovering a little bit more about that program and what we can do and, and, and work our way in there because we don't have it in there. Um, so we'll see about that. Um, I'm also, uh, on Monday, I'm also going to go look at another large residential job that, uh, that we're looking to get on as well. Uh, then we got projects starting Monday, a few projects starting Monday. So that's what's going on. You know, growth is, uh, is, uh, is crazy right now. We're happy for it. Um, and that's it. So, um, I don't know why I keep doing this own thing. So you got any questions, hit me up. Uh, let me know what you think about all this. Uh, oh, <laughs> another thing is the Serpro thing, right? The, uh, the customer we call, we call, we titled that the, uh, the Downey house possible loss, right? Uh, so it's not really, to me, it's not really, now to me, I did lose a portion. I would say that 12 grand I lost, right? But now the way it's the idea I got from my wife that I pushed forward, I think is like phenomenal. And it sets, it definitely sets me apart to create a partnership on a whole different level. I basically said, I'm going to give you a percentage of the jobs that you give me that you already get a percentage of. I'm just going to give you more of a percentage and still make my money that I need to make. So basically it shows them sending me work, them getting a, more of a portion of the work that they're sending me, and we're both happy. And we both grow to, to have very successful companies. So, so I mean, and, and, and this guy pays me early. I mean, it's such, I'm, I'm, it was definitely a different approach than I ever have taken, you know, but I think it was a very smart move and top half, top. Hats off to the wife for coming up with that. And, um, and then I'm putting that packaging it together and sending that out to that, uh, to that owner. He still hasn't reached out to me, but I'm in constant contact with one of his project managers. And of course we, you know, I got other projects that's coming up that I'm doing with them too, like six other projects. That's not gonna count toward this new deal. Any new jobs will count toward that. So their goal is to give me large jobs to be able to pay that back as soon as possible um, or give them that percentage back as soon as possible. So, uh, and the way I structure it is that usually we do 40, 60, 40. So I get, so, so all the, const the construction value of the project, I take 60%, they take 40%, right? So how I structured it, the, this program or this deal, I structure, they get a minimum of 5%, and then that other percentage will vary depending on the value of the job. So I don't really have a value outside of the 5%. So literally now they'll get 45%. We'll try to, well, let me say this. They'll get a minimum of 5% on top of the percentage I give them. 
So the original deal is 60-40. But when we go into a construction project, sometimes it's 80-20. I get 80%, they get 20%. Because of the way the estimate is, I'm like, hey, that can't work. And they already submitted it, so they can't go back. So now they have to take less. So sometimes I take 80%, they take 20%. And when that happens, then they'll get 25%. So I give them the 20, and then I'll say, hey, you get 25%, okay? And then I'll take 75%. You get me? You get where this is going? So that's how that works out. So not all the time is going to be the same percentage. I'm going to determine what that value is, where we need to be at, and then I'm going to tell them, hey, this is where it's at. Now they can say, hey, no, we're going to find another contractor to do that particular job. They can say that, you know, but I'm in so tight. I'm, 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 I'm trying to help benefit them so much. There's no other option but Tyrone. That's what you got to understand. I'm turning the numbers quick. I'm doing work. No callbacks. I'm hitting them so, so hard in so many areas. It's like you have no choice but to use me. Call Tyrone. Call him. Have him do it. Have him go out there. Tell him what it is. Tell, let him tell us what it is. And that's how it's working. So I love, love that deal. So I'm going to let you go with that. I'm, I'm, I'm definitely going into 20 minutes here. Don't want to take up too much more of your time. Let's get back to it. Hustle hard. Then hustle harder. I'm going to try to do some more videos today. Look out for it. Let me know how you guys are doing. Speak up. Leave a comment. Make sure you share these videos. I'm sharing a lot of content, especially about that uh, free worker that you can have, that admin worker that you can have in. Share that. More of us need to know about that. There's, there, there's so many things that are against us already working as a construction entrepreneur. We need to gain these nuggets so we can pass it on to help others so we can build this thing to where it becomes easier. Okay? I get excited with that. I, I, I just get excited. But anyway, I'm going to let you guys go with that. Hustle hard and hustle harder. Catch you on the next one. My construction.